Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Virtual Skills and I am Latiful Bari with you. Hey what's up guys, in this video I will show you how to repair corrupted system files or restore Windows missing files by using command prompt easily. To find Windows command prompt, just search in your start menu for CMD. As I told you in my previous video, you should always open your command prompt with run as administrator to avoid any kind of error or interruption. Now right click on your mouse and open with run as administrator. If you have missed my last video where I have showed how to find detailed system information and network IP addresses using command prompt, then check this video description you can find the video link. However, to repair system file error, just type sfc space slash scan now and press enter. I think it will take some time to complete this scan. In the meantime, I would love to give you some more information about this specific command. As you all know, Windows is a product of Microsoft.com, so it is the best resource for your information. Here you can see, this command will act as a system file checker tool to repair missing or corrupted system files. If some Windows functions are not working or Windows crashes, use the system file checker to scan Windows and restore your files, like as I told before. Now here you can see, this command will scan all protected system files and replace corrupted files with a cached copy that is located in a compressed folder at Win Directory System32 DLL cache. Anyways, and on more important note, do not close this command prompt window until the verification is 100% complete. The scan results will be shown after this process is finished. Here you can see the message, Windows Resource Protection did not find any integrity violations. This means that I do not have any missing or corrupted system files in my Windows. Thank you so much guys for watching this video and don't forget to share your opinion in the comment section. And subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. Thank you.